Hello. Today I'm going to talk about how to divide a Twine story into multiple files using the special passage story includes. This requires a fairly recent uh, version 1.35 beta and above. I'll put the link in the description for you. I'll start by showing a an example project of mine. This is a story I'm working on called Spaceboat and you'll notice that the TWS file, the, the main twine file, only has four passages in it. This new thing here called story includes. Now if we open up story includes what this does is it contains all of the files that I am going to use inside my twine story and when the twine builds the story the recent betas that understand story includes will run through here look for these files open them up and add the passages inside them one by one to the outputted story so you can see on the side here I have a list of the files and it more or less matches what's here the ordering is a little bit different but that doesn't actually matter um, you'll also notice that there are some files, for example, these ones that are not in the folder. These are actually uh, contained in a relative folder. The story includes will support subfolders. It will also support HTTP and FTP URIs. Story includes uh, supports .tws files and it also supports .twe files. I personally prefer to use dot uh, twe files because they are just text and I can edit those text files using anything. For example, if I store this in Dropbox, which you'll notice that I have stored this in Dropbox, then I can use a text editor on my iPad to create my Twine stories. But TWS files work just as well you'll notice that in my start passage all I have is the text display real start now real start is in one of the included files somewhere okay so this is uh, basically all you have to do the reason why you might want to do this is because it enables reuse of macro code and style sheets between different twine stories it also enables you to stop the story map getting too complicated and it also allows better collaboration because different people can be working on their own files at the same time 